everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I'll be showing you how to make a leftover rotisserie chicken soup in your Instant Pot. And in the spirit of Thanksgiving, I wanted to say thank you to my supporters and subscribers. So I went out and bought a brand new Instant Pot to give away to one of my lucky subscribers just in time for all of the holiday cooking. So whether you're a new subscriber or you're already subscribed to my channel, you're automatically entered to win this 6-quart Instant Pot with all of these great accessories. The rules are very simple. You have to be subscribed to my channel in order to be entered to win. You have to watch this video until the end and name your favorite quick and easy recipe in the comments down below. And for a bonus entry, share this video to your Facebook page. I do have to keep this Instant Pot giveaway to US residents only because overseas delivery is not guaranteed at this time. It's as simple as that. A link to the official giveaway rules is in the description down below. One winner will be selected at random and announced on Friday, November 20th, 2020. So if you haven't already done so, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell down below and you'll be automatically entered to win the Instant Pot giveaway. It's free to enter, now let's get cooking. Here I have a leftover rotisserie chicken that's already been picked apart from last night's dinner. Check for any loose bones and remove them prior to cooking. Here's four cups of chicken stock, one medium onion, chopped, three quarters of a cup of shredded carrots, eight ounces of dry pasta, a tablespoon of salt, a teaspoon of pepper, and a bunch of each parsley and dill that I finely chopped. Place the leftover rotisserie chicken into the Instant Pot. Now add the onions, carrots, noodles, salt and pepper, chicken broth, and eight cups of water. Give it a gentle stir and cover with the lid. Make sure the spout is set to the sealing position. Press the soup broth button and adjust the cook time to 5 minutes. Turn the keep warm button off. Allow the Instant Pot to perform a natural steam release when the timer is up. Carefully remove the chicken with a skimmer and a pair of tongs and set aside on a plate to cool. Check for any pieces of chicken or loose bones that may have fallen off during cooking. Look at how rich that broth turned out in just five minutes because we left the chicken on the bone. Once the chicken is cool enough to handle, separate the chicken from the skin and the bone. Use your fingers or two forks to shred the chicken into bite-sized pieces. Put the shredded chicken back into the pot and add the chopped parsley and dill and stir gently. Check for seasoning and add more salt and pepper to taste if needed. Now serve and enjoy. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button down below if you haven't already done so. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.